Hey, this is Doc JT. I wanted to talk to you about the legs, the feet, the calves, and the hips. This is all something golfers really notice after they've walked, let's say, six and a half miles. Uh, even if you're in a cart, your legs get extremely fatigued and you're thinking to yourself, wow, I'm out of shape. Um, six and a half miles shouldn't be that hard to walk. What you have to remember is that the force that is generated through the hips, the torque on every shot, whether it's the driver or the longer irons, or even kind of a squatting position for your wedges, can really impact the way the legs and the calves and the feet feel. So what you have to understand is that every time that you go and mark your ball on the green, or you pick up your ball from the cup, that's a lunge or a squat, and you can be doing that over and over again throughout the round. So a four hour, four and a half hour round can be incredibly taxing to your body. Again, with that generation of the uh, torque of your feet to drive that ball further. So one of the things I always recommend is to use a foam roller after the, your golf round and make sure that you're really hydrating yourself as well because your muscles are 80% water. So many golfers will tell you that power comes from the feet and the grounding of the feet onto the, uh, onto the turf. And then again, that spinning gyration motion creates kind of this torque throughout your entire body. So treat golf like a sport because it is a golf sport. And um, you know, you'll be happy that you take care of your body before and after a round. Have a great day.